Hi, Mike Kurtz here from Hawk Sport Optics. Today we're going to talk about the Hawk BRC system, the Ballistics Reticle Calculator. The Hawk Optics engineers developed the BRC system to make you a more accurate shot in any distance. The reason we can do that is because most programs use BC, ballistics coefficient of a bullet traveling through the air. That's theory. We use effective deterioration, which is how your bullet actually flew through the air. We've now brought up the Hawk BRC system on our screen and we're going to walk you through the basic steps of how to set up your firearm. The first thing you need to do is enter the chronograph muzzle velocity of your firearm. Only use the manufacturer's velocity if it's a last resort. The next step we're going to do is to create an ED value. ED stands for effective deterioration. We can do that two different ways. We can do it from a point of impact change or a velocity change. Today we're going to select the point of impact change. With the data box open under the zero range, what we're going to do is enter 100 yards. That's our first shot from this gun. Okay, what are we watching Mike doing right now? Okay, Andy, what Mike has done is he zeroed his gun at 100 yards. Okay. We just put a fresh target up and he's verified his 100 yard zero. Now what we're going to do is we're going to move that target out to 150 yards and then he is going to hold on the bullseye as he did uh -huh. and then what we're going to do is we're going to measure the amount that the bullet dropped okay so we're going to create an ed in the brc program with a point of impact drop okay so we'll get this target moved he'll take the 150 yard shot and then we will measure what the difference is we'll be able to verify and we'll verify it through the through the computer program we will be blueprinting this gun. Outstanding. All right. Carry on, Let's Mike. do it. We're going to take our second shot at 150 yards, so we will put that number in and enter that. Okay, so what did we just learn from this? Well, what we've got to do is we need to go out and we need to measure the, the amount that the bullets dropped. It's probably dropped a couple of inches or so. On the point of impact change, our velocity is going to slow down so our bullet will drop. This will be a negative number. In this caliber, it is 2.58 inches. Once this data is entered into the text box, we will hit the accept button and it will refresh the screen with the new data. Step three, scope height. This will be from the center of your bore to the center of the scope. Step four will be our zero range. This will be the range that you are going to sight in your firearm. Step five, this will be magnification. Magnification is going to be what you normally shoot your firearm on. In step six, we're going to select our reticle. Click on the reticle tab, a text box will drop, slide down and select the appropriate Hawk reticle. Now that we've collected all of that data, we're going to name it and save it so you can use it as a future reference. So we will click on File, select Save As, name the file, whichever is appropriate, and click Save. Now that we've saved that data, we've basically blueprinted your firearm. We can use that data in the future to modify your future shooting situations. If you need more technical support, please call us at 877-429-5347.